everyone, welcome to my channel. So for today, I'm gonna be unboxing all of these boxes here. They're actually another box right behind this humongous Dior shopping bag. So I'm so excited for today's video because these are all of the purchases that I bought recently and some of the gifts um, that I got from my husband for Christmas. So I would like to share everything here. This is a unicorn chair that I borrowed from my daughter. She she was really happy to you know let me borrow this unicorn chair for today's unboxing. I don't want to make this video too long so I'm just gonna go really quickly and it's gonna be only an unboxing video. I promise that I'm gonna be you know making review videos on these items as well in the future for my channel. So if you like these kind of videos please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and let's get right into it. Because this is the only shopping bag from Dior. I'm just gonna open this one first. Um, if you follow me from Instagram, I think you've seen this unboxing already. I actually unboxed it and ta-da! It's a Dior cardigan. Oh my gosh, this is uh, my very first purchase from Dior, the clothing. So when I bought this, sweater from Dior in Korean one it was 3 million Korean one for this season they also have this the same sweater with different colors they have uh, black and gray color this is ivory color so I think it's pretty steady item from Dior it's a sweater I really like a cashmere sweater so cozy and I really love it so I decided to um, it on here. Uh, the Italian size for this one is actually 42. I um, bought a huge size for this because um, I don't know if it's a trend for um, this year or something but arm sleeves are really short so I don't want to you know wear really short sleeves because when I wear I tried on 36 and the, the sleeve was like right here it was really short so I don't I usually wear size 36 or 38 but I didn't want to wear that um, cardigan with really short sleeve I think it's maybe the fashion trend or something but yeah I decided to go for either size 40 or 42 and I think this was more suitable for me because I have a long arm so 42 was really great for me so this is a little bit huge on me in general but i really like it um these button details they have like cd cd and i like the pattern knaj pattern that they have like entirely it's really flat but this knaj pattern entirely on the so I can totally wear it with my office look and I can also wear it casually. It's not really warm or really hot so you can you know wear it like in any season. And I like the color here too. I'll show you the mod shots right here. I paid um, 5 million won in Korean won so it's around you know 4,000 somewhere around there. Um, I usually bought like Chanel clothing previously but I'm really into Dior these days so I really love it. So let's go on to another unboxing. So talking about clothing, um, I bought this from the website called ukes.com. I'm not sure if you're familiar with this but the company is really huge. Company selling luxury items including handbags and clothing and shoes. Um, so I bought um, these clothing and these shoes. So I'm gonna be unboxing these right now. So they always wrap it up with uh, this paper. So the very first item is this one. This is Soak Blouse from Dolce & Gabbana. I really like it because of the lace like here on the neck, on here, and on the bottom as well. So it's brand new and I really like it. It's 100% silk. So I think I'm gonna be enjoying it so well. Um, let me try this one on as well. 
this feels really good actually and i really like the the lace here it's really feminine i actually bought this one for my daughter it was a little bit huge on her so i decided to try this one on and it was like perfectly fitting on me i'm gonna show you more shots on this too um i really like it because you know you can wear it i think you can wear it for any season too because it doesn't have arm sleeves so you can wear it with your you know t-shirt during summer without anything and because it's needed dress that you can wear it with your sweater you can totally wear it during winter too and summer as well so i thought it's gonna be like really great i actually tried this one on and wearing this one with my um coat on top of it so i really like it i think i'm gonna be enjoying it so well so i really like it Let's go on to this Roger Vivier shoes. If you can find, you know, really great deals from I don't know, use.com, farfetch, matches.com, those kind of websites, they have, you know, Black Friday sale and recently Cyber Monday sale as well. So I got these items in really great deal. The original price for these shoes are usually more than, you know, $1,500 in US dollars. But I bought them like 60 to 70 percent off. Just look at these. So pretty, oh my gosh. I like these Swarovski embellishments and these are so great. Oh my gosh, this is so sparkly. Actually, I was planning on wearing these for summer, but my Instagram friend, she actually told me I can totally wear this one in winter as well because it's in silver color so it reminds me of you know snowy days i can wear it with very thick socks i think it's gonna be really comfortable for me because it's elastic on the back and they have this ribbon that i can transform into ballerina flat Um, Roger and Vivier, they are really popular for their blingy and sparkly Swarovski shoes. So excited for this one as well. Oh my gosh! Ta-da! Oh my gosh, these are so pretty. Look at the details. I love pearls. And these pearl details are so cute, feminine, and very elegant. The heel height is about 5 centimeters, so I think it's just so perfect. I think 3 inch for the heels are just perfect. The color, it's not, it's not just white, it's patent leather, but it's like rainbow color. So in different angles, it turns into different colors. So I, yeah, I really love it. And inner sole is in silver. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. And they also give you like extra outer sole for the heel. Excited! Let me remove the ones that I unboxed already. Okay, so I have more room here. Let me go on to this one from Damiani. So they give you like invoice. Oh, they gave me this postcard. I think it's their model. Miami from Korea. So they give you invoice. Box. So I'm gonna be doing a review on this item as well. So if you're interested in, please um, hit that notification button so that you will be notified if I upload that video in my channel. So here, ta da! Oh my god, this is so pretty. I also did the unboxing on this item as well from my Instagram channel. Um, I actually bought this bangle. It's really lightweighted bangle. Um, flower motif. This is called Margarita bangle. And it's actually lighter than uh, my other bangle from Cartier. Just include SM size with diamonds. This is thinner than that one. It's hollow bangle inside, so it's really lightweighted, but it's so pretty with these combinations. I bought them purposely to match up with like this. So yeah, so excited for this. Finally, I think some of you might be really interested in to know about this unboxing. 
Um, I got this gift from my husband. She gave me for Christmas gift. And we are actually gonna be going somewhere for this Christmas. And our wedding anniversary is also coming. It's like three days after the Christmas. So we are planning on a trip to Europe um, during that week. So I'm so excited. And he was like, oh, I can just give you right now so that you can enjoy it during the trip. So I'm so excited. Oops. Ta-da! Oh my gosh! So I'm also gonna be doing a review on this ring as well. But right now I'm just gonna be unboxing it and wear it. So this is just so perfect. I really like it. So we are down to two unboxings now. So because this is another clothing, I'm just gonna be unboxing it right now. So this is from Chanel. I actually bought it like October or September, I don't remember, but I actually bought this one for this winter. It's not a jacket, it's a cardigan again. I love cardigan and I prefer cardigan more than jackets. It's this one. Oh my god, this is so pretty. Um, I think whenever I wear it, like I wore this cardigan when I was getting um, this cardigan from Dior. It shows the mood of Chanel so much. I've been having this cashmere um, sweater from Dior like years and I just bought this one and worn it several weeks. But in my opinion, I think the cashmere quality from Dior is much better because um, it got really fluffy. It got, even though it's cashmere, it got really fluffy and there are like so much pluffs. I had to go to the shop to, you know, remove those pluffs. So yeah, it's like in brand new condition now, but that was the only thing um, I had some sort of complaints on this cardigan. But it's so beautiful, so I still love it so much. Okay, very last unboxing. I'm pretty sure you'll be very interested in to know about this unboxing because we all love Chanel handbags. I bought a um, seasonal piece from Chanel in this summer and I'm really enjoying it. But this one, I cannot get it from the store, from the boutique anymore because it's a discontinued piece. So because it's a brand new condition handbag from Chanel, but it's not from this season. It's from 2018 or 19 or around that year. Yeah, I think they wrap it up really nicely. I got this one from consignment store. Boys, and you see and all that here. I think the year they produce is 2018. Yeah, 2018 and it was phenomenal. It was like really popular color during that year. And I'm not sure how it's showing on the camera, but it's like a little bit darker than the red color or original red color. So I want to compare, you know, other red bags that I have. I feel like these are really similar. These are actually really similar to each other chevron pattern diamond quilting so as you can see this is more classic than this one um, and on the back i've been saying this one like for over and over again but for chevron pattern you cannot avoid the 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 flat wrinkles when you open it you get like this wrinkle you cannot avoid these wrinkles for chevron pattern but i think it's kind of more manageable for diamond quilting so it's you still get wrinkles but it's like less than the chevron pattern that's that and this is roots cassock from hermes and I think these two red colors are pretty much similar. I also did a comparison video between rectangular mini versus um, Constance 18. So if you want to check that out, I'll put the um, link above. These are more like red colors, true red colors. And this is more like orangey red color. This is coral red. 
I think. So yeah, I love red colors. I'm so excited. I paid more than double um, price for this one. It was uh, it was around three thousand dollars, actually thirty two hundred dollars during that time, and I paid more than double than that. Well, I think rectangular minis. I think compartments and you know capacity is just more than perfect for my you know for me anyways that's it for today thank you so much for visiting and watching this video and visiting my channel i hope you enjoyed it and if you need any sort of information please let me know again and thank you and i'll see you on my next video